Hello guys, so today our vlog is about what's on my camera bag. So I will show you what's on my everyday backpack. Uh, what's inside on this bag. So let's for without uh, further ado, let's start and I'll show you what's inside my camera bag. Okay, so before we start to open what's inside my bag, I'll show you also my other bag. My other everyday sling bag, which is the Billingham Hadley Pro. So I always use also this bag if I don't carry all my uh, gear for vlogging. Sometimes if I want to bring only my um, one camera for vlogging, then I use this uh, bag. So again, let's start to open the my everyday backpack. Okay, so let's start. First, my bag is a Wandard uh, PRVKE 21L or 21 liters bag. So, yeah, I choose this bag because uh, you can uh, load up to two to three uh, cameras inside. And yes, first, the tripod. So I have the tripod on the side. Inside. Yes, I choose this uh, tripod. It's a zero V. It's a travel uh, travel type of tripod. Actually, there's a ball head inside. So, but the ball head I use now on to attach my mobile on the top. So, but I always use this uh, tripod first because it's uh, light and it's uh, yeah, it's a travel type. So, but the length of this tripod is uh, enough for my it's a good enough for uh, a normal tripod size okay let's put here and yes if you can see we have one uh, zipper here oh, the memory card okay. then you can put your tripod here or you can put your tripod monopod in the side on the back side you have another zipper small zipper so you can put something like your passport and yes some small documents ids then from the top you can check out another zipper or yeah i put here all my batteries my batteries um, yeah another like card or any small item so I can organize all my batteries all my type of batteries it's ready here okay. and I have one memory card here and I will uh, make a content on this memory card one day okay uh, what else the front and this side is for your laptop and ipad and this is the main okay so before uh, we open the main i'll show you also that uh, there's a side here that you can locate and you can easy access for your camera so this is the easy access for your camera so if you want uh, to take a snap or photo um, easy uh, then you can remove your camera here on this side of the bag so yeah you can see my camera but we will open the main okay so we will open now the main location from the bag which is the one at the back so this is the like a front because here in the front it's empty like uh so it's more safe for a thief <laughs> so it's more safe when you travel so at least your, all your gears is at your back the zipper is at the back or the the main is in the back let's open up okay so first here at this side we have your laptop i think it's a 15 inch laptop and i have here my ipad it's a 10 inch ipad but uh, it's damaged now, so I need to repair. And this is my uh, Tenba SD card 
folder I have all my SD card here I need to um, if, if you have a full memory card already so at least you have always a backup so this is a must for photographer videographers that you have always an extra memory card and extra battery on your back so for the main okay so let's start to open the main one okay. from this side you have the zipper and another zipper and that's it this is my main camera and my main uh, yeah, vlogging camera so first I have here the Rode Video Mic Pro Plus. This is my shotgun microphone for vlogging outside. Yes. And yeah. next, it's I have a small camera here, which is a backup camera for street, for every day. So I have the Leica X1. So it's an 2005 model and 12 megapixel camera. I have a um, content or vlog on this one. You know, I think it's one year ago. So yes, it's a ma APS-C crop sensor uh, camera with 12 megapixel. So, still, I'm using this one. Right? And I love to use this uh, camera because it's, it's too basic and yeah, I have the flash and it's too light and I like the built-in quality and the looks yeah the Leica X1 for the photo then my video camera so this is the camera that I use always on my vlog my Fuji X-T2 yeah Fuji X-T2 with the 1655 uh, f2.8 lens this is the only one and yeah I don't have plan to buy another lens actually I have the 14 uh, mm uh, f 2.8 Fuji lens but I saw because I don't shoot a lot of uh, landscape so I rather keep only one lens which is the 1655 2.8 yeah this is similar with the 2470 uh, Canon Sony and Nikon and um, yeah right it's a 2.8 lens or Sigma but the only now there's already X-T3 and X-T4 uh, but uh, still I love to use my X-T2 and I don't have any plan to upgrade soon for X-T4 because at the end of the day I'm using only 4k 30 or full HD and the slow motion this is more than enough for my needs but the screen yes I have an issue for my screen because yeah, the flip screen it's only like this <laughs> so this is my issue only on my camera but yeah, it's not a big issue and I have solution on that that's why I'll show you uh, what is my solution on that so first this is the X-T2 my main camera for video for my vlogging this is the main camera again X-T2 it's a very nice camera and my photo camera so this is the all uh, this is the camera that I always use on photography yes on my street on every day on my thumbnails yeah the Leica Q and I have uh, this last previous uh, vlog this uh, camera that I uh, that I use and yeah we test for vlogging so what's the and the video quality it's very nice yes it's a bit very nice but yeah the only downside is you cannot put a uh, external microphone because there's a there's no 3.5 jack microphone uh, not same with the the fuji the fuji have 3.5 jack so you can put external microphone on this that's why i have the uh, road video micro plus and again guys why I choose the Rode Video Micro Plus because first the battery 
it's a lithium battery your chargeable lithium battery so it's very nice or if you don't have any uh, lithium battery then you can provide a double a two pieces double a uh, battery on this so, but it's very nice because uh, the chargeable battery so, just recharge on a USB I forgot why I don't have a vlog on this in the review but uh, I think I'm gonna review one day on this uh, Rode Video Micro Mic Pro Plus with that cap so when you purchase this one actually it's uh, purchase this uh, Rode Video Mic Pro Plus this is the box and this is what include on the box so you have the USB uh, yes it's a micro USB and actually this is the main shield on the road video micro plus but i i rather use the dead cat so it's more uh, better sound quality because it will reduce all the uh, annoying uh, sound like a noise or wind so it reduce on this wind uh, dead cat in one day we will make a review on this uh, Rode Video Mic Pro Plus because I forgot to make a review on this but we will uh, one day maybe one of these days we will make a review on this microphone and again back to the camera again the Leica Q it's a very nice uh, camera it's a full frame uh, camera with uh, 24 megapixel I always use this camera for my street and portraits and every day every day uh, yeah every day photos okay. so I'm gonna have here and the next one is this side yeah it's like a Kikai kit <laughs> actually it's not a boss it's not the headphone because I remove the headphone and I put my accessories so first I have here the also this one the monitor I uh, forgot to make an unboxing and review I have the field word monitor uh, 5 inch field word monitor I use this because of my Fuji yes because the screen of the Fuji is flip on this side so you cannot uh, see what's your frame so when you're vlogging you need to put this um, field word uh, LCD monitor so at least you you have idea for your frame and uh, yeah frame focus so like that you have the zebra and everything so we will make a uh, another review on this monitor yeah so this is the purpose why I have uh, a monitor Again, so we have the monitor here. Okay, and also the small mat box or uh, yes for the monitor. So if you shoot outdoor, at least uh, it's uh, yeah. And we have here my Saramonic microphone. So this is. One of the best uh, lavalier microphone. Actually, it's not a. It's like a similar lavalier, but yeah, it's a wireless microphone. So this is your transmitter, transmitter, and this is the receiver. So, you know, I have the cord here. So, that's here, and it will go for your camera. So this is the receiver, and this is the microphone, guys. So, I always use this one on. Um, my vlog especially indoor so, yeah. or any interview this is a very nice microphone for interview I have also a uh, separate vlog on this review on this microphone when I first when we first we received this uh, microphone so I purchased for myself yeah. and also the HDMI cable so at least you have HDMI cable for your for the monitor Fieldward and for my camera and this is a very uh, special adapter 
so yes if I want to uh, download my movie file or video file on my Fuji XT2 then I use this to transfer and the top of the bug so this is like a open storage of the bag so that's why you can put in all your gear inside this bag so first we have I have here my headphone so I have the boss headphone so if I want to monitor and to check the uh, my audio on my video I have this boss for monitoring and even for my sounds I love music guys this is the jack and I have here my aperture LED which is the the one I'm using now the aperture uh, AM ALMX so I have this personally on my bag but it's too small and yes and actually it's a waterproof uh, light LED light so I use this to catch uh, Alimasag. <laughs> Actually, I'm, I'm using now the lights. That's why I cannot uh, I can show you the light because it's on. Uh, it's on right now. It's I'm using right now. Yeah. Then I have here a very special mini tripod. Actually, this is the small tripod from the. Marans. I have a microphone called Marans MPM 1000. So this is a small tripod. Then I have this uh, Benro N2 ball head that I purchased and I bought in Haraj. Uh, Haraj guys uh, use uh, item or use items and gears that you can find there. So not only for photography but all in general. I use this uh, small tripod for. Uh, especially if I make a vlog on my sneakers because it's for low angle yes so it's a Arca Swiss type of ball head and plate that's why I have here an Arca Swiss plate on my like a uh, Q and for my XT2 it's already Arca Swiss this uh, plate uh, this is a flip not a plate uh, this is a metal grip this is a metal grip of Fuji XT2 this, this uh, area is a metal grip and what else I have the this pump uh, lens pen pump air yeah. this you can I always use I always clean my gears guys every time I use from outside then I have the battery, the NP battery for the LED monitor. Charge battery. Then the microfiber, it's a very useful uh, accessories for clean your gears microfiber and I have the lens pen the brush ah, so if you want to brush your uh, camera some of the area it's very hard to clean that's why you have a brush and this is a lens uh, cleaner this one and I think that's all uh, item what's inside on my camera bag and guys show you my bag and what's inside and that's it for today guys so this is all the gears on my bag so, yeah this is most of the essential gear that I everyday use on my vlog again guys uh, before I end the video of the vlog, I want to shout out of my team, which is the team Positive Vlogger. So shout out to you, shout out to all the admins and all the members and especially all new members from the team. So welcome, welcome po tayo sa ating team. 
Then also I want to flex my team here in Kuwait, uh, Team PVK. So shout out to you all guys. And uh, yun, stay safe lang tayo mga mamat sir. And um, again, sa kung sino gusto mag-join ulit sa grupo, kontakan niyo lang po si LL Chan. So, so ang napakabait na admin na si LL Chan from Japan. Uh, check nyo ang kanyang ano, um, uh, vlog or ang Chanyan channel, sorry. Ken guys, hanggang uh, dito lang. Thank you very much and mabuhay tayong lahat. Bye.